What is going on with you boys? A little bit different video than normal. I'm going to be showing you guys on how to basically resell anything in what field you guys are in. So that could be from golf balls, shoes, golf clubs, you know, anything that you guys know the market on or know your market on. I'm gonna show you guys on how you guys can just quickly resell things for quick profit. Um, so right now we're just on offer up and we're gonna be taking a look at a couple of different sneakers and see what we can find. Um, Let's see what these are. So how we're gonna look at these sneakers and we're gonna try to see if we can make a profit on them is we're just gonna have to really understand what you're selling and what you're trying to buy, right? And so you're really, the first step is just to see what the product or whatever you're buying is worth. And so, um, for example, for shoes, um, we're gonna take a look and we're gonna check market. And so we're gonna go to StockX and we're gonna type in Race of Dunks. And then those were he had looks like a size 9 and a size 11 so it looks like size 9 and 11 markets 170 um, last sale um, one good way to check to see if the shoe's moving right you want to see if the shoe's moving every day and see if the shoe is actually selling so you can see it's consistently going for 160 170 um, pretty solid prices just sold three hours ago for 220 uh, size 11 so he's asking 185 we would probably want to be anywhere around. So with this shoe, you know, we're gonna check other markets and see what the other markets are going for. But with this shoe, we're probably gonna to wanna to be right around 140 or so. So let's see, like you don't race uh, size nine and size 11 is going for 185, 190. So we're gonna offer them a quick, we're just gonna say, hi, is this still available? I know people probably do not like that at this point, but. Okay, and let's just kind of keep going. We just asked and we just see, right? We're just gonna check to see if it's still available and then we're gonna offer. That's really all you can do. You just offer on prices and if they say no, it's okay. Um, let's see, what does he have here? He has a size seven youth and a size, or in a Kobe eight. Um, let's take a look and see what that market's going for. Jordan for Lightning or uh, shit. Sorry about that, boys. Uh, Jordan for Thunder. It's a GS pair. Seven Youth is going for 240. So honestly, not terribly priced. Um, we're gonna also see if this is available. So the whole moral of the story, boys, is we're just trying to see if shoes are available. We gotta see. Um, just check to see if the shoe is available. See what they have it priced at, and then understand what you're trying to buy and realize okay well if the market is at 190 180 um being able to sell it under that or even sell it just where people are paying for the shoe right you're going to want to make sure that you're buying the shoe for a price that people are actually going to pay for the product so you can't you know i mean you can any anybody is willing to buy something for any price but some something where you can really get it off kind of quickly um that's anyways of what i do there's a bunch of different ways to resell sneakers and you can buy them hold them for a while to keep them going up or even just try to get the top dollar um put them in you know whatever you're really wanting to do anybody's willing to pay the price you just got to really get it out there and so um if whether or not the person's paying you know it's somebody's out there willing to pay the price it's just um what's somebody actually paying consistently just keep going here I'm too crazy. So we're gonna type in uh, we're gonna type in Jordans. So let's type in Jordans and see what comes up. Um, we're looking for stuff. I personally have been doing it a while, so I know what moves well and what doesn't move well for me, anyways. Um, and so I know what to kind of keep my eye out for. You'll learn that once you start selling sneakers a little bit. But honestly, like I was saying, you're just gonna go to order history or purchase histories and see how often the shoe's moving in general, right? And just see if the shoe's moving every day. Let's see what these golfs are going for. Size 11 Travis Scott golfs. They're size 11, they're going for $1,100. And the last sale is $830. Let's see if these are available.
This guy hit his back up with the with the Jordan 4s. Um, yes, it's available. Negotiable. I'm payment ready. And then also Isaac hit us back too. So this is huge. Um, Isaac hit us back. I'm going to say negotiable. I'm payment ready with a little smiley face. And then this is a good deal. I can get these. Let me see what I want these for, to be honest with you. I personally like being at payout, boys. So if you guys can get shoes for a round payout, that's where you want to be to make your margins. If not, a little, you know, depending on the shoe, you can pay a little higher, a little more, but um, size 10, 216, we're gonna, oh god, that's not gonna go, um, we're gonna see if he'll take two, I mean, depending on where you can meet, but, that's a good shoe, I mean, that you can definitely make money on. This guy says, if you can meet in Des Moines, I can do $200. Okay, well, that's exactly what we're gonna do, send the address. So just seeing you guys how easy and quick that at, I mean, just asking if they're negotiable and I was going to honestly offer them 220 and the guy just said $200. And so I'm telling them to send an address and we're going to go pick those up right now. Super simple. I mean, just asking questions, closed mouths do not get fed guys. And so this goes down for anything. So yeah, we're telling that guy, send an address and we're coming right over there. So he just sent us an address, um, uh, master burger. Okay. We're going to go grab those right now. Let's get straight to it boys. Thank you. Pretty big lemonade. Can't go wrong. Definitely kind of mid. There you go. Thank you. Okay. All right, boys. So now we're gonna take a look at this cheeseburger and see if it's good or not. Junior cheeseburger, so not like a big one. This place is called Master Burger Meister. This place is called Master Burger Meister. Cool packaging, a little old school style. I said light on the sauce, and not too light. I can't lie to you, but I don't know. Let's see. Mmm. I'll tell you this, I probably won't be going back here ever again. Um, tastes like a gas station cheeseburger. It's these guys that are just living life. These guys are the ones that are living the real life. We're just straight chilling on the Harley, wearing music. Hell yeah. How we doing boss? I'm Corey. Isaac. Nice to meet you. Sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> nice to meet you. Got my sneakers out. Nice. Yeah, but like uh, they don't have an image for some reason. Oh, you know, you're back good. way back in the day. Yeah, the, the yeah, you're good. You care if I just put them on my hood real quick? Yeah, yeah, come on. Sweet. And uh, if you have anything else, I'm always buying stuff. Yeah, yeah. I can always just kind of cash you out for it. Cool. Yeah, never worn or tried. Yeah, no, they're clean. Awesome. And then um, 200 was good for him? Yeah. Cool. Let's do it. I got you. I'll just, uh, you Apple Pay good? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let me just snag the number and we're good. Yeah. And I'll hang tight, you say you get it. Perfect. Thank you, brother. Awesome, man. Thank you so much. And boys, it's honestly really that simple. Um, that took what that took all of 15 minutes of my time markets right up here i'm gonna probably end up selling those for you know 250 to 255 or so so we're looking at a 50 dollar profit um really quick 
those are going to go really fast for 250 i honestly probably can get more but i know that 250 we're going to get them off pretty fast so it's really that simple though boys all you got to do really is just look up market look up what the shoe or what a, look up whatever value whatever item you're selling look up what the price is going for what is it moving at what is, is it moving a current is it moving a lot is it going is it actually selling every day is it something that's a hot item if it is you check out what price it's selling for or selling at sell it a little under you know if it's moving at if that golf club or if that item is moving at 150 dollars constantly and we can move that item at 140 130 and it you know and it sells fuck it you know let's just keep shit moving i'm gonna catch you guys on the next one let's go